Welcome to SNN News, and I'm Spencer Zimmerman. According to President Trump, the only problem with the economy is the Fed. While the post-Christmas boom uh, actually resulted in uh, the largest uh, point increase in the stock market ever recorded, uh, over a thousand points, uh, and the stock market had entered 2018 strong, uh, we also will leave uh, the year with the biggest Christmas Eve drop in history. Thanks to the actions of one man, Federal Reserve Chairman Jay Powell. Throughout the year, Fed watchers have been pleading with the chairman to ease rates so that the Trump boom isn't stopped in its tracks. And every time he has ignored their pleas and raised rates, Powell's actions, seemingly bent on destroying America's roaring economy, have led some to speculate that he is in fact a member of the deep state working against the president to undermine Trump's 2020 re-election. A real-world example of the effects of the chairman's actions <clears throat> were evident when it was revealed in July of this year that due to pressure exerted by the Federal Reserve, the big banks had rejected 75% of all small business loans submitted by America's entrepreneurs. Conservatives have been saying for years we need to abolish the Fed. At the very least, they're also saying now that it may be time that Trump used the two words he used so often on The Apprentice and terminate a chairman who is clearly working against his administration and the American people.